Designing a logo has many steps and process involving research, brainstorming, sketches, and several design concepts. That's what graphic designers and ad agents do. Many businesses hire a designer or an agency to create their logos and their brands. One could end up paying over $1,000 or more. Or they could hire someone from Fiverr and pay as little as $5. You get what you pay for. Save your money and house in dealing with Fiverr. Go ahead and use Adobe Spark. Would the design look like clip art? Yes. Are you okay with that? If the answer is still yes, please watch the next few minutes. Other online logo applications will charge you at the download stage. With Adobe Spark, it's free. Without the need to purchase or learn design software, Adobe Spark can generate hundreds of logo variations using basic information about your company and design preferences. You can edit and tweak your designs. And Adobe Spark does not even charge you if you want to download the image. Download the logo as an image or as a PDF. Let's get started. Let's go to your web browser and type in spark.adobe.com. Log into your Adobe account or create a new account to Adobe Spark. You can link any of the following, Gmail, Facebook, Apple, Adobe. You can also use your school account if you go to school as a student or a teacher. That brands in your account, click on create a brand. Where it says no logo, click on this step. A web link will show you to click on the logo maker. A great logo would tell the complete story by looking at it. Do you see the arrow in the FedEx logos? Watch the 75 negative space logo video. The logos use a type of logo design concept that smartly uses the white space. Adobe Spark will ask you to fill in the blanks and tell them about your business. I won't bother with slogan. Choose a style and I pick bold. You can flip this around if you want to to see other variations later. The icons will be popping up on your screen or you can type in a different suggestion if nothing shows up for you. Select an icon and Adobe Spark would create your logos. Scroll to the bottom of the page and change a different style from modern, elegant, or decorative. Let's flip it to modern. A different set of logos will open. They all look the same to me. So go ahead and pick one. In a minute, we can customize it. To customize it, you need to save it first. Click on Customize. It will save the logo. Don't worry about adding your brands or posts at this stage. Let's get the logo out of the way and click on a color. Click on the color box and change it to the color you want. Click here. You can watch Foundations of Design to gain more insight into colors and topography. At the side, you can fool around with the different edit tools. Click on the text. If you decide to change the name, select the pencil icon. If you want to change the font size, spacing, opacity, go ahead and change it to what you want or desire. Finalize your logo and click on download. You can select your logo to be an image or as a PDF. If you open the PDF in Adobe Illustrator, the logo itself is a vector file. A vector logo is a preferred choice for print ads, a flyer, poster, or billboard. If you want to learn how to get a logo from a PDF, click on the above link. To make your life easier, download it one at a time. Check it out. There isn't a watermark. Congratulations, you have now created your logo within a few minutes for free. Thanks everyone for watching. If you enjoyed the video, like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel. And I will see you next time.